Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. So in this video we will solve a very common problem in VS Code uh, that is including the bit slash stdc++.h header file. As you can see if we try to include this header file our VS Code is showing us the error that it cannot open source file bit slash stdc++.h. Now let's try to open the same file on another code editor. Uh, I will demonstrate it using uh, code blocks as you can see when we try to open the same file using code blocks it is showing no error so now let's try to understand why this error is occurring so first of all what we're going to do is we're going to see what compiler we are using for this so if we go to go to I will show you again if we go to settings and compiler we can see the compiler that we're currently using as you can see we have multiple compilers so we are using this GNU GCC compiler uh, in code blocks. Uh, the other thing that we want to look into is that the compiler directory it is program files x86 min gw and the path is like this okay so this is this is in case of code blocks this this is something that works so now let's see what what settings we have in VS code so how do we visit that uh, visit our compiler path so if we hover onto this uh, we're going to see the button quick fix and if we click on it we're going to see a few different uh, options so we're going to select edit include path settings so it, it's going to take us to the this extensions uh, intelligence configurations and as you can see here the compiler path is not the same as the one in our code blocks I will show you again in code blocks our directory was mingw 64 but in VS code we have something totally different so what we can do is we can choose the same path for that so we we, we were using uh, this gcc.exe uh, let us recheck it we don't need let us recheck it here uh, so we can go to compiler and if we go to tool change settings uh, if we go to the very end we will as you can see this is our C++ compiler gcc.exe this is the file that we're using so we're going to select it here also and after that you will you will also see that intelligence mode with windows this is also incompatible with compiler path so we're going to change that too so since we're using windows and we're using gcc and this is a x84 x64 device so we're going to choose gcc x64 as you can see there are no errors anymore and we have successfully configured our program and if we go back to this you can see that this error no longer exists so this is how we can solve the include error for bits stdc++ on vs code thank you for thank you for watching my video uh, see you